Kevin. At Drake University, certain measures are in place to keep students safe. University IDs must be swiped to enter buildings, emergency phones are installed around campus, and public safety officers patrol the grounds. But some students feel that in certain places, this isn't enough. There's like a core to campus that they keep very safe, right? Walking on campus always feels very safe. But then there's other areas that are a part of the Drake University community that are not controlled or like protected by public safety at all. One place that doesn't feel so safe? Greek Street. Three blocks west of Drake's main campus is a two block stretch that is home to the universities, fraternities, and sororities. Earlier this week, two freshman members of the SAE fraternity were robbed at gunpoint on this Greek walkway, a path connecting main campus to the Greek street. Greek housing, while it isn't owned by the university, is provided exclusively to university students, and so I think when public safety gets to a part of those issues, they handle it to a very minimal degree. When I see the way that they're managing these more in an attempt to protect maybe like their bottom line or what they technically have to be responsible for, I don't feel very protected because it's more about did we technically do our job so we can't get in trouble and saving their own ass instead of trying to like genuinely protect the students.